Legend has it that ranking in karate arose from an ancient tradition of martial artists never washing their belts. White belts turn black from years of dirt, sweat, blood, and dedication. The more knowledgeable the martial artist, the darker and filthier the belt. As the modern enlightened, we know a thing or two about legends. They're always true. If you wash that belt, you could wash away mastery. Wash your black belt, and you could become a white belt again. White means death, and that initial white belt symbolizes the sacrifice required to reject your old life. Shit, I still need that. Only after years of discipline to achieve enlightenment. At black, you've conquered your fear of death. There is no better way to show your fearlessness in the face of death than by training with a cesspool around your waist. A long, healthy, safe life is for the weak. True warriors take unnecessary risks and die young. And that black belt could one day save your life. One night after a weapons class, you might get attacked on your way to your car. Simply wipe your weapon along that petri dish of a belt and plunge it into your attacker's belly. Instant sepsis, and you go on to live another day. Herpes, warts, ringworm, scabies, shingles, thrush. <laughs> Impedigo, Staphylococcus. These are just words. They mean nothing. Martial arts are about building a strong community. So what if that community is mostly around your waist? But all that knowledge and filth can make your belt a little hard to tie after a while. In this next video, I show you how to loosen that tight little bacteria-loaded stiffy right up.